This little microchip could be about to revolutionise COVID-era air travel. The chips, known as biosensors, are coated with a material that attracts and binds with the coronavirus. When they bond, the flow of the charge through the device changes, allowing them to provide a positive or negative diagnosis. The biggest advantage of the semiconductor chip is that it can obtain a very accurate result very quickly. In fact, we can do it within three minutes. Our procedure is also automated so we can avoid false positive and false negative results. The speed of the test is a breakthrough governments around the world have been hoping for. Many countries have mandatory quarantine periods in place to prevent travellers spreading the virus. But having a test like this one directly before boarding a plane may mean quarantine periods could be reduced. This system would work in airports and train stations where people need to move in and out quickly to do tests. It's like the drive through at McDonald's. You just walk in to provide a specimen, sign a few documents, and when all the documents are filled out, the results are ready. Many of the current tests available do not return results for days, and they require not just sophisticated labs, but also trained staff to carry out deep and uncomfortable nasal swabs. The new rapid test needs none of that. The specimens it uses include the existing swabs, blood specimens for antibody tests, and also saliva. This means that anyone could extract specimens by themselves and use the test machine alone because the technical threshold is very low. This new test means bustling airports could become a reality again. However, it will come at a price. At the moment, the cost of a rapid test is about $270. But over time, that's expected to drop to around $100. Sarah Morris, TRT World.